This is what Hunga Tonga looked like on the 8th of December, 2021. The eruption of the 15th of January, 2022 practically destroyed the island. This was taken on the 16th of January. No more island. Now this capture was taken by Japan's Himawari 8 satellite. The ash plume grew to about 250 kilometers in diameter before the wind started to distort it. Here you can see the shockwave again from the Himawari satellite and the terminator line due to the earth rotating away from the sun. Now this is an infrared capture of the ash cloud of the Hunga Tonga eruption by the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. Also the eruption was heard as far away as 9,000 kilometers. This animation was put together by Dr. Matthew Barlow, which shows the shockwave moving all the way around the world and converging into northern Africa and bouncing back, just like waves in a bathtub. Members of the Tonga Geological Services captures the Hunga Tonga Hunga Haapa eruption lightning and a large pyroclastic flow moving out into the ocean. Here you can see the pyroclastic flow on the left hand side of the volcano. Now we're going to speed it up a bit so you can actually see the pyroclastic flow in action. You can see how the pyroclastic flow expands and moves outward into the ocean. You will also be able to see some lightning as well, in which I'll be able to slow it down and show you the lightning bolts. Here are the lightning bolts in the first clip. And there's going to be another clip that'll show you another lightning bolt as well. These two clips have been slowed down 10 times. The next two clips after this have been slowed down 100 times. Now this shows that the lightning is actually traveling upwards into the ash cloud. 